So I want to welcome you. My name is Diane McMullen, and I'm a professor of music here at Union College. And we're really happy to have so many people here from different constituencies. I recognize people from the AGO and from UCAL and students and faculty and staff and the community and also people from different nationalities who have gotten to know Stefan. This is his fifth visit. Um, it's really something when I think about it. All of the notes he has played on this campus. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, so uh, I want to bring to your attention the different events that he has coming up. I've listed them here already on the program and you can read them for yourself. Um, I would especially, especially point out to you the concert on Friday evening, uh, which is going to be very exciting. Sandy Weimer is senior lecturer here at Union College, and she and I have worked together for oh, almost a year trying to put this together. And um, her students in the winter term were assigned a print, were assigned a movement in Mussorgsky's pictures at an exhibition, and they each one made a print. And um, we will unveil them on Friday. <laughs> and you'll get to see them during the performance of Mussorgsky's Pictures at an Exhibition. <laughs> Played not on the piano, which is how Mussorgsky wrote it originally, not the orchestral transcription, any of them, by the many dozens who did that, but rather played on the organ by Herr Kiesling. So it should be very exciting to see all of this. And this, it's, it's like a first time ever for all of the people involved because the students will not have, the students who made the prints will not have heard the organ version of it. And uh, Stefan and I have seen the prints, but putting it all together, that's the first time. Friday, seven o'clock. So <laughs> try to come, it should be very exciting. Um, I, at the end of the concert today, there, we have a reception during which you can meet Stefan and there's some nice refreshments over there. Um, and Stefan also has a recording available. It has works of Bach, and I have it right here in my hand. He has um, so several available here like this. If you find this too heavy to carry home, um, you can buy this. And um, with this, you can download it, and then you have it wherever you go. I mean, you don't even have to carry around this, which is kind of heavy. Okay, so whichever one you want, okay? Um, and it's $15, so if you're interested, come writing up here because it's limited quantity. I have quite a few of these, but not so many of these, okay? You can also buy them online. It's in, the information is in the program. So um, I want to thank Stefan for finding his way here to Union College. He has been traveling all over the world since we last saw him here in this space, 2017 in September. And uh, so it's very exciting to have him here once again. We're going to start off um, with everybody singing. Are you ready? Sure. <laughs> the students know me, right? I've tried every opportunity to sing, okay? So Stefan is going to play for us the theme of the Pasacaglia. If you don't know what a Pasacaglia is, basically what you need to know is there is a theme that is going to, you'll hear it on the harpsichord alone at the beginning, and then you're going to hear a number of variations upon it. What you may not do, we are going to practice the theme. We're going to sing it through once. What you may not do is to sing it during the performance. <laughs> okay? So with that, um, let's give a nice warm welcome to <coughs> Thanks everyone for coming here and of course thank you so much Diane. She has done so many work to put all those things together here and finally I'm here for one week and it's absolutely great. Thank you so much. And for me it's also wonderful to have the opportunity to play uh, the harpsichord and especially the pedal harpsichord. Uh, in my biography I played the harpsichord before of course but unfortunately it's kind of difficult to play one regularly and I would consider it as one of my um, loveliest hobbies still. <laughs> <laughs> so it's absolutely fine for me to do that for you here now. The pedal harpsichord is said to be the practice, practicing instruments, instrument for the organist. Uh, at the, those times where we didn't have electricity, uh, the organist always needed someone to pump the air. And I came across that problem once uh, it was Christmas time some years ago, then suddenly there was kind of a power failure. 
uh, during the Christmas service, and uh, all the uh, men from the congregation they queued up to do the pumping at the organ. They were very excited. <laughs> okay, for the panopticon, you don't uh, need this. Some organists are saying that uh, Pasacaglia and also the six trio sonatas are especially meant for the pedal harpsichord. I am not quite sure about that because the, the way a pedal harpsichord sounds is so much different from an organ and when I was practicing those pieces on the harpsichord I kind of needed to make a, a transcription for it to get a little bit more sound out of it. So for my personal opinion it's really an organ piece that I'm now transcribing a little bit for the harpsichord. But anyway, I don't have Bach's telephone number. He's not on Facebook anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you can't ask him. So, uh, yeah, the title of that little recital is Mr. Johann Sebastian Bach's very best pedal piece. This is a phrase that one of the copiers uh, wrote on a sheet of paper. You know, at that time, there had been no, no copy machines, and it was not so common to publish all the compositions because. Um, the main goal was imp to improvise pieces. So many of the organ works by Johann Sebastian Bach um, are still now existing because other people copy it then by hand. And there was one guy who was writing after the uh, G minor fugue at the bottom line, Mr. Jo um, uh, the German phrase is das allerbeste Pedalstück vom Herrn Johann Sebastian Bach, the very best pedal piece by the Mr. Johann Sebastian Bach. <laughs> and it's probably still the best pedal piece today. So we're starting with the Pasacaglia, and Diane already warned you, you have to be part of the concert today. I'm going to play the theme from alone, and then we do all this together, right? Yeah. With Diane, with Diane's help. <laughs>
coming, for listening, and if you have any questions, I'm more than happy to answer you. If you like to purchase the CD with the last piece on it, I'm also very happy to give you one. And yeah, enjoy the noon and the afternoon. Thank you so much. Thanks for Thank coming, you. and don't forget about the rest of the